A pleasure to me all at last, and here we are with HJN Season 3, yet again. I really gotta say, though, lots of things have been getting quite a bit easy, if you ask me. Easier done than said. But what I will have to say, first of all, is that this is episode 1975, or 1975. Preferences are there, in case you need them. But anyways, we got topics all over the place. And if there's one in particular that I'm going to want to highlight soon enough, it's training. Yep, the one thing that allowed Goku and Vegeta from Dragon Ball Z to get stronger. The one thing that's allowed for army veterans of all sorts to become better suited and equipped for combat out there in the field. The one thing that us civilians in America will most likely take upon as a means of making ourselves better in any possible way. I, of course, am talking about training. And so, if I could say anything else, I'd probably be here all day. So I'll just talk specifically about the subject entirely. A good definition that I can bring up here is training. The art of practicing in the means of getting stronger or better suited for a fight. And fighting is of course one of the main reasons why training is there. But many of us do oftentimes use training on our bodies as a means of making ourselves stronger for other potential reasons. A lot of us can appreciate the aesthetic that muscular systems can basically give us. Ever have yourself an abdominal pack, be it six or eight or other such number that's there? Have you ever had yourself that lovely aesthetic of having your arms bulge out nice and huge? Have you ever imagined possibly being any larger in size, transforming into a powerful being beyond comprehension? Well, that's just the thing here. If you ever have done muscular training, then we both know what is to be expected. I myself have done plenty of that over the years. I've had a Planet Fitness membership now for about five years. And I've had myself plenty of time spent out there ensuring that I can stay in tip-top shape at all times. And there are tons of different equipment at my disposal. Plenty of different techniques that I have been taught about and lots and lots of time that I have been able to piece together to make this stuff happen. And so that's basically just a good starting point as to what we could expect when we're out there at the gym, at the dojo, or even out there in a the combat zone. We tend to take this stuff with pride and determination. And more importantly, we have confidence in ourselves knowing that someday there could be a very big problem in life. And not only are we going to make ourselves bigger, more powerful, and better than we could have ever been in our whole lives, but the art of training, making ourselves stronger, making ourselves more resilient to certain diseases, making ourselves better than who we truly are. These are all goals that many people have taken upon themselves. Nowadays, lots of people take up exercise. It's crazy to imagine the kind of times that we've been through. An obesity epidemic had occurred, so what happens? The people were more concerned about their health and their weight and their body. Way more concerned. Quite a shocking reality check if you ask me. It might happen again, so that way, it seals the deal. And America will be way, 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 way lower in terms of the ranks on the fattest countries in the world. It may rest at around 18th or 19th place at the moment, but chances are, it could go up again. Higher ranking, possibly because someone messed up. Who really knows? Otherwise, there's lots more to it than just basic fundamentals and understanding yourself as a whole, mentally and physically. As I've said before though, 
I only want to be a little more basic in terms of defining what training is and setting a good example for those who are in fact wanting to try this thing out for themselves. But, of course, if I talk about certain things too long, I'll definitely be stuck here for a while. So I'll just end it right here and now for the sake of continuing HJN in a simplistic way. So, that's all I gotta do for today. But if you wanna see more, go down to my channel, then, simply put, please like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.